All right, I'm going to do a review on my watch. It is a Casio G-Shock. It's uh, Mudmaster. That's what the uh, model is. Uh, this is it here. It uh, It's my favorite watch. Long story short, it has a big face, has all the gadgets. Um, I am going to show you some of those things in detail, but this is the watch and uh, it's terrific. Okay, what I'm going to do today is I'm going to review the Casio G-Shock Mudmaster. This model is GGB100-1. A. And uh, let me show you what comes in the box. Essentially here's a, just a hang tag that goes with the watch when it's on display. Uh, also it comes with an owner's manual that gives you the details. Um, it's uh, several pages, multiple languages, has illustrations uh, to kind of walk you through uh, some of the setup. Uh, here's a warranty card. And then here's just uh, a little brochure uh, with details about this specific model. Anyway, um, so, oh, and here's just a little card, just a little uh, card that has some kind of marketing material, goes with it. Some more marketing material. The watch itself, uh, this is what I would call my daily driver. I wa wear this watch, I have probably maybe eight or nine watches. This is the one that gets all the wear and tear. I wear it the most and it's my favorite watch. Um, it's easy to see, it's got a big face. There's contrast without being you know, obnoxious. They, they do have one with the white numbers, but I went with the gray numbers, which I quite like. Some of the features on this phone, the primary feature that I got it, and I ride motorcycles and I'm always at different elevations, so I got it for the altimeter, which you can see here, um, 4,500 feet, that's kind of our home elevation. And you know, when I'm either skiing, if I'm up skiing, I can tell what the elevation is on the lift or at the top of the mountain. I can just push that and see what the, what the elevation is. The other feature that I really like on this, around here it's not as necessary, but it's a, it's a compass. So basically you can click the compass button and the second hand becomes a compass. So you can see base, you know, I'm always, I'm rotating at different directions and the second hand becomes a compass, which is really handy. I like that a lot. Um, another feature that I like a lot is the light. There's um, a light, so in a theater you can just uh, push that light. It really lights up the face. It's easy to see in the dark, which is also very handy. I like that a lot. It has a number of alarms. You can do different time zones, uh, international time and your own time zone, which is uh, really handy. And some of the other, the, the thing that I also like about this is this clasp back here I have some other watches where, that have either single or double clasp and it seems like these things always come off and this always starts flat, flapping around. But the reason I like this one is it just does its job, it does it well, it holds it in place and it's just uh, no fuss. It does a really good job of just holding that band uh, in place. So there's that. <clears throat> The other thing that I want to show you is, and this is really kind of the tech part, is that it will connect to my cell phone. So here's the watch, and there is an app that you download from G-Shock, and you uh, essentially download the app, you pair it by pushing this button here. There's a fine red line around the outside of the button, so you just push that button, and then what it does is it pairs with the app on the phone. So now um, this is the app uh, that is connected through Bluetooth to my watch. And so uh, kind of left to right there's a guide so you can essentially go through and uh, excuse me go through the guide and learn about the features of the watch. Um, 
here is a mission log so if you're going to do let's say a specific hike and you want to essentially keep track of distance or time or uh, calories or something like that you can can create a mission log so that's what that feature is <clears throat> the next one is a step counter um, it it asks for my height and weight and age and then based on that information and the steps that I take it estimates how many calories that I, I'm burning so 3225 steps uh, has burned about 1700 calories which is kind of a handy little feature um, in here it's the different times so you can go in here and create different time zones international time and then my local time so if I want to change the time rather than do it on my watch I can go in here click the time set the time set the time zone and then send it to my watch and then it will automatically update the time on my watch which is an awesome feature I love that a lot as opposed to trying to mess around with the watch itself and then this just has all the different uh, alarms that you can set so you uh, it looks like there are five, <clears throat> excuse me, five different alarm options, a timer option, a signal option, um, which are all, you know, really good features as well. So that's uh, kind of the app in a nutshell, but uh, has a lot of uh, features that go with the Mudmaster. Now the reason they call it a Mudmaster is it's kind of essentially designed for hiking, camping, outdoors. It's designed to, to get wet and endure mud whether you're ATVing or camping or hiking or hunting whatever that might be um, and it's uh, it's done a very good job of uh, staying dry I've actually uh, been boating with it I've been swimming with it it's been underwater and it uh, hasn't it hasn't got any water under the bezel and even when I've been around water I've had water I've had other watches that get kind of like a fog on the inside lens but this one has stayed clear and dry it's very comfortable in terms of you know wearing it there's no pinch points as a matter of fact um, they did a really good job of here in the corners where it meets the watch they've uh, created little kind of transition areas where it transitions from the band to the back of the watch back to the band which makes it very comfortable and um, as per the light I mentioned it's easy to see it's you know if you're in a theater or in the dark or outdoors whatever that might be uh, just you can hit the light and see what time it is or you know anything on the uh, face um, sometimes if it's dark or if I'm you know going or stumbling around the house in the middle of the night or if I'm up and around in the middle of the night and <clears throat> if I can't see something it actually becomes bright enough that I can essentially hit hit that light and it turns into a little mini flashlight it lights things up just a little bit so you can kind of see your see your way around which I think is also uh, very handy but again this is the mud master it is a terrific watch I really like it a lot and it has served me well in the 14, 15 months that I've owned it, and I'm very happy with it. So I strongly recommend it. It's a terrific watch. Thanks for watching.